Hello friends and welcome to... Oh, forgot. Hello friends and welcome back to... Oh, fucking back, really. It's been two days. Two days. Hello and welcome to Everyone's Gone to Rapture. Hello guys. Oh. I will get this. I will get this. Okay. Three. Hello and welcome. Hello friends and welcome to Everyone's Gone to Rapture. Hello friends and welcome to Everyone's Gone to Rapture. A story game that I have no idea it's going to be about. I'm just going to get right into it and hope for the best, really. Um, okay, language. Voiceover. This information is on the third. Uh, oh, no, some titles are on, obviously. This title is an autosave feature. Please not turn off your PlayStation 4 system while the autosave icon is displayed. Amazing. Okay. The emergency may occur. Bliss or no warning. Be prepared to meet any emergency may be key to survival. Okay. So, everybody, everybody's gone to the rapture. I have no idea what to expect, but that's why I love my games. Like this. It's a story based survival, I'm guessing. But. I don't know. Can we get though? I hope. I hope so. Zombie's good. I mean, the doing zombie. I mean, obviously I've not played it since we left the video. But um, that was fun. Um, yeah. Hopefully this is going to be very good. I've decided to speak a little bit quieter, a bit more softer in this video. Because uh, my zombie video I watched back, I was a bit like... Ah! <laughs> so um, this one I'm going to be quite quiet and uh, soft and spoken. Push forward the narrative. Yes, it was a narr narrative game, which I guess it should be. Okay. This was set up. I think my hair looks like a mess. I got This is Dr. Catherine Collins. Oh no. I don't know if anyone will ever hear this. It's all over. I'm the only one left. The Chinese Room presents... Everybody's gone to the rapture. Observatory, nice. Wow. Okay. Um, I'm confused. I don't really know what to do. Door. Nice. Shropshire Magazine. Okay, we're in um England. Counting King. Tip before visiting. 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 Okay. That's weird. I'm going to continue to broadcast for as long as I am able. If I'm right, you should be able to pick up the signal right across the valley. The event has left markers. We don't understand it yet. We're going to keep working to try and understand it. You can use them to find what you're looking for. Okay. The answers... They're all here. Oh, The answers the are in answers the light. The answers are in Amazing. the light. What does that mean? I'll look for light and I shall find answers, I'm guessing? Can't really sprint... Oh, okay, there's the door. 
Okay. I can't really sprint, so it's very much a walking game. <laughs> Get to the bite. Okay. Which I guess is good because it allows us to. Who's ringing? What is good? Ring? Okay, I'll answer it. This is a special announcement by the Emergency Measures Committee. Due to exceptional circumstances, radio and television in this area has been brought under the control of the EMC right. as per the Crisis Preparedness and Action Bill of 1982. Oh, yep. Keep your radio and television on at all times. <laughs> okay. Stay Check. indoors and avoid contact with other people. Check. Do not attempt to telephone outside your local area. Check. Do not panic and remain civil Check. and calm. Amazing. Stay tuned to this station I mean, for I don't updates. Really do that anyway. <laughs> no idea. I'm not that. I'm not that much of an introvert. But um, if that, okay, like, sort of like an epidemic happened. Just remain indoors at the first thing you do. You wouldn't go. Oh my god, epidemic! Let me run outside and try and do stuff. You'd be like, nah, I'm staying indoors. So who's Valis? What is Valis Corporation? Who are they? Can I check in this car? Let me drive. No. Okay. Apparently, I can't drive. Um. Okay, I guess, because I don't want to be driving in an epidemic. I don't really know what's happened. I've gone to this game completely blind. Oh, there's a lock there. Am I trying to look for the key for the lock, maybe? Oh! What's that? What's, what am I doing? What am I doing? What the hell was that? Whoa, my controller's fine. Shine up. That's insane. I'm trying to do my job. You two will be the only staff on site for this rotation. I'm just saying, if the main gate's power fails, then there's no way in or out of the observatory. That's why there are backup generators. Jesus, why the hell are we even discussing this? Just don't you come running to me if you get locked in. If we get locked in, we won't be able to come running to you, will we? You let us worry about the clever stuff, and you can concentrate on sweeping up leaves Whoa, and Steven. changing light bulbs. Happy? <laughs> now piss off. Ah, so. That was unnecessary. Just because you're angry with me doesn't mean you have to take it out on everyone else. Kate, can we just talk about this? No, mm, Stephen, I'm done. I just want to get out of this place, and tonight is our best chance of doing that. You prep the arrays, I'm heading up to Tower 6. Kate. I love you. You know that, right? Yeah, I know that. Come on, let's get started. What? I don't, I don't under oh, it's back to normal. Okay, I don't understand. Like, what was that about? I don't, what are these, what's this? Are these parts of, like, uh, memories? That become, like, physical? Become sentient? In the sense that I can see them? Man like, the, me the memories that manifest into light? I have no idea. I mean, it's very interesting, though. It's asked, you know, a lot of questions have been asked already, which is good. This. I like this, I like this, I like this, I like this a lot. That's pretty cool, so you, you turn your you controller to uh, unlock the the memories of whatever it is. Oh, there's another one down there. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Hello? Cross me. Jeremy? That's, that's Jeremy, is it? The, the people! Where are they, though? Why have they, why they become embodiments of light? What's happened? Oh. <coughs> what's, what's happened? Have us a road. 30 miles per hour. Point. This game is beautiful. Look at it. Oh, look at the sun. And stare directly at the sun. Oh, Jerry, Jesus Christ. Okay, can I, can I, uh, anyone else? I'm gonna catch this Jeremy dude. Uh, I can go down the head to the main town. What is... What is up here? That's one, I don't know. That's where I've come from. But you walk really slow, but you, you do cover a lot of distance, to be fair. Okay, road closed. Um... Oh! Oh! Well, I suppose from that we can assume that they really are serious about this whole quarantine thing. If Mrs. Balton wandered off that way before they closed the road, I suspect we'll never find her. 
Not until this whole thing blows over. Well, it's more than a little odd. I mean, this is Yorton, for goodness sake. There was no need for them to be so rude. Well, if they are so concerned that they are willing to close off the roads, I suspect they would argue that there is every need. What is certain is that for the time being, none of us are going anywhere. But he had a rifle, a soldier with a rifle, in Shropshire. The world's gone stark raving mad. I've a good mind to write to my MP. You do that, Barb, and I'll personally deliver it for you, once this blockade is removed anyway. Come on, Bob. I can't spend all day chasing pensioners around the valley. The surgery won't open itself. I need to grab some paracetamol when we get back as well. Fucking headache all of a sudden. They, they gone? Okay, so let's talk to Wade. Oh, bruh. Oh. So obviously something big has happened that's caused people in this town in Shropshire to be put back. Well, to, to be like, what? Pulled out of this universe, and they're now the spirits of some sort of uh, ethereal sentient being, which are like replaying the last moments and or something. So, like a, uh, an event has happened, uh, like it said, that has caused this. And I'm, which, I'm guessing we're trying to figure out what it's caused. Are we? I'm guessing we're human. Or oh, what? Are, or who are we then? Are we Catherine? Are we? One of the people. Are we? Jer are we Jeremy? Are we Jeremy? Are we Jeremy? No. I like it. Asking questions. I like this a lot. Okay. So, oh my. Yeah. One of those things you don't see every day. A phone box. That's new. Wow. Where have they gone? They've disappeared off the uh, face of the earth. Really nowadays, aren't they? Phone boxes. Jeez. Oh no way. You kidding me? Is this Doctor Who? The TARDIS? Hello? They enter the TARDIS? Oh, oh, oh. Who's that? Hello? Kate, if you can hear this, you need to shut down the optical array. It's using the observatory as a conduit to reach us, and it started spreading its range beyond the valley. Kate, we can't afford to let it do that. It's getting stronger. I'm going to call Clive back, and I'm going to force him to order the strike. I just don't see what other choice we have. Oh, no, can you hear one. me? We need help. Who are you? Jesus, get off the front! Get off the front! It's in the front! It's in the front. <laughs> what happened? What was that? What was that? So, Who's that? Am I okay? No, that's another, that's another, that's another memory. That's another array. thing being played back. What is this? Is aliens? What is going on? Alright, I'm entering Yorton. The main town. Oh, 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 what is this? What was that? Is that black hole? This, yeah, this is some sort of sci-fi, supernatural stuff going on here. Oh, I like it. If you guys didn't know, sci-fi is my favourite genre. I love sci-fi. Oh! Yay. Don't be so hard on yourself. We've all had rejections. You haven't. <laughs> oh, come on. We'll look at the figures, tighten up the data, and resubmit. Your core idea is sound. You just got the number slightly wrong. Don't patronize me. I'm not patronizing you. I think you are a brilliant man, Dr. Appleton. Listen. I'm here, right? We're together, you and me. The alignment event tomorrow. It's yours, okay? You saw the opportunity, you ran the numbers. Even if they can't see it. I'm proud of you. Is that supposed to make me feel better? See you then. Look on the bright side. I'm around here? <laughs> You're a hero. Prodigal son returns, right? <laughs> I'm surprised they haven't erected a statue in your honor yet. <laughs> oh, you can laugh all you want. But I'll bet the parish council have a subcommittee working on that right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, so definitely Whoa 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 whoa. Kate and the Stephen fella have got something going on, obviously. But 
A lime? Oh, hello. Derek, you massive... <laughs> okay. Um, yes, an alignment event. What is that? What is that about? What event? See, look, all the animals are gone as well. Humans and animals have disappeared. So something has... The, the alignment event must have pulled in something from like a different dimension. Like, pull this in, and then everything else, everyone else has gone, bloop! So I, th I, th I think, okay, I'm gonna, I th what I think has happened is, what was that over It's for Jeremy, running around with people weirdo. Yeah, maybe. What I think has happened, right? They've obviously aligned, it's a bit like the Hedron Collider in the sense that, like, they must have created a massive black hole, which is like, engulfed the whole of Yorton, like a bubble. And everyone that was inside it has been sucked out like to some different dimension and all that's left down is their like previous memories but their previous memories are manifested into these balls of like etheric light in a sense as you see this going around now so all the stars I mean I'm, I'm the stars with stars tonight but uh, there's a pub <laughs> but that's what I think that's what my theory is at the moment I think they've created they've done some sort of experiment and it's caused a black hole to suck everyone out and replace them with etheric balls of light Quarantine. This area has been quarantined and sealed as per the dead. Do not attempt to leave. You will be detained. Do not attempt to uh, turn the phone outside your local area. Please keep your radio on at all times for further information. Great. They don't enter this house at all with my garden. This game, I'm saying it again, is beautiful. Is that something? <laughs> I think I was going to be in here, but I have music playing, so... The latch is up. Right. Why? Why is he giving me all this to explore? There's no purpose to it. Maybe there is. Maybe there is something over here. Maybe there's a needle in the haste... ...ale. Nah. Let's get a little tractor over there. That'd be amazing if I could drive that. Probably can't. But it's giving me all this room to explore. With no obvious outcome. So why? So why do that? So why? That is the question. Why? Why do this? Oh, weasel. Bike pulled. That's probably going to be weasel. Uh, okay. That's probably going to be uh, important to remember. Bike pulled weasel. Okay, shovel, shovel, shove. Chairs, shed, open. Oh, okay. The voice of the stars. Extraordinary. The whole thing reminds me of high school. <laughs> Seeing Mars for the first time. That same rush of excitement. <laughs> My hands are what? shaking. Oh, from the observatory. Seeing Mars for the first time, she must, it, she must be reporting from the observatory. Okay, that's fine. Um, I was thinking, what? She's just seen Mars for the first time? How? No, from, yeah, from the observatory. That's the only possible conclusion I can make from that, otherwise she's been to Mars. Or seen it through some sort of like parallel, or some dimension space-time rift that they might have created. Maybe they... Oh, there's another one over there. Okay, I'll have to go to that. Go, just go, ooh. Close until the further notice, we've got the flu! Please try the seventh whistler. We'll be back in business as soon as we're up and about George and Helen Gables. But the door is open! Who did this? Who did this? Okay. Okay, what is that? What is that? Is that beer bong? Oh, it's beer bong. Interesting. We are down some beer. We chug a chug chug. Today's special, local fish and chips. I'm at, wow, that cigarette is still smoking. That means someone's been in here. Pub quiz, Wednesday 8 p.m. Curry and a pint, only two pound. Brilliant, that's, that's bargain deals right there. Play some darts. Okay. L the day, 50p. That's some, this is a good pub. This is a really good pub. Why are they saying alcohol 50p? Doesn't she crappy alcohol or something, but 
That's really good. Okay. I don't really know how, to, how long I should make this episode, to be fair, because there's so much going on. So much to happen. I kind of I kind of want to keep playing it, but I'm gonna, I know I've got to end it soon. Alright. Okay. I keep looking, but it makes no sense. The area we picked the pattern up from can no longer be located on the scope. That's just not possible. You can see significant changes to the quality of the ambient light in that part of the sky. It's overexposed. Oh, like a I mean, uh, something's happened. Sunlight. Something, if it's not there anymore, and they, they've looked at it through the telescope, that means it's gone. It's like shifted in, in time and space, obviously. It's shifted. But where? They pull, I'm thinking, I'm saying, I'm, they pulled it into the here. That's they've done, they've shifted it to Yorton. Everyone must have gone, like disappeared. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. Oh, Jeremy! Freaking Christ! You know, they uh, see me as an outsider here as well. Is that supposed to make me feel any better? You know, I understand it's difficult. That's all I'm saying. Your lot up at Vallis have never mixed with the local community. People here, they don't really understand what you do up there. Are you trying to get me to come to your church? It's not just about faith. It's about the community. Be involved. Be seen as part of it. One of them. <laughs> Good morning, Father. Lovely day. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, Mrs. Appleton, isn't it? It's Dr. Collins. Lady scientist. Whatever next? Good morning, Barbara. <laughs> Father Wheeler. You really think that's a community that will ever see me as one of them? I can live with them staring at me. If they just stay out of my way. Okay. Right, 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 right. Okay, so there's a bit of tension going on between the community. Religious, religion and science obviously clashing. Um, these houses. Yep, gates open. House four. Quarantine stuff. It's locked. Every house is going to be quarantined locked, that's awesome. Look at these butterflies, that's amazing. Okay, I, do you know what, I'm going to leave it here. Let's watch the lovely butterflies, okay. You know, guys, friends, this episode, this game so far is absolutely amazing. I'm loving it, I hope you guys are enjoying it too, the mystery and how people have dis disappeared from a city but still there. You know, pre previous most time. Uh, Prevalent memories are being played out through etheric balls of light. Just, it is beautiful, you know. At the moment, it looks it looks like a game to be played. You know, it looks like a must-buy at the moment if fans of sci-fi and the supernatural genre. But obviously, we don't know. It might be in front of when we both play on. We're what 20, 20 minutes, 23 minutes into the game, and it's amazing. So thank you guys so much for watching, for staying with me for this long. Um, Please leave a like if you liked it, comment what you liked about it, and stay tuned for more. Everybody's gone to Rapture. See you guys later. I'll see you guys later. Bye bye!